Hello. Obviously, another big uh, test in front of you with Tied to Ivasa, but you had to come all the way to Perth for this fight. So I guess, how is camp, and what are the emotions now that you're only a few days away from actually getting to fight Ty? Um, big fight, yeah. I feel good. Um, it's a, walk for a long way from home. Other than that, I've been here for uh, 10 days, uh, and I have a good time, make new friends. So, uh, were, were you happy with the matchup with Ty? Because, you know, you fought in these in these grapplers, but you've found a lot of success against strikers, and Ty is obviously famously, he comes in and he likes to throw hard in there against fighters. I mean, happy is a, it's not happy, but it's a fight, and we in the heavyweight division. So um, I'll fight anyone in the heavyweight division. So um, style-wise, it's uh, better, but it's MMA. I'll never count the wrestling out. So, yeah. And what what are you expecting from Ty uh, when you do fight him on Sunday morning? He's on a little bit of a, a slide in his career, but you know fans still love him, and he still seems to want to go out there and fight. Um, like when I look at him, when I look at Ty, is a is a guy. He doesn't show fear, and that's what I'm looking at this uh, Sunday, upcoming Sunday. So. Um, if he comes out different, that'll be weird. But, but show no fear that that's it. So when you go forward, he's dangerous, and that's what I'm counting on. And there's some footage of him. Uh, he was sparring with Alex Pereira uh, when Alex was down here, and uh, he was touring. So uh, do you think you can actually, he actually learned some stuff from Alex, and what do you make of them training together? Um, he definitely can learn something from, from other fighters. Uh, Alex is a great fighter, by the way. So, uh, yeah. I saw it, uh, and I, I can't say much about it, but, yeah. And two more quick ones unrelated to your fight, but in November, the, the new rules are going to be implemented with the 12 to 6 elbows, and the grounded opponents will be changed. I'm curious, did you hear of this news, and do you like the new rule changes? I just heard about it now, <laughs> but it's sick. 12 to 6, cut somebody open, split them in half, sick. <laughs> um, and last one for me, can I get your thoughts on the main event between Drikas and Israel? Crazy. It's a, I think it's going to be a great fight. Um, I'm a big fan of Izzy. I met uh, Drake a few days ago. Cool guy. I hope it's a hell of a match. Juzino, right here. Um, right. You've had a couple fights, and there's been like no movement at the top of the division, really. So we keep asking you almost every media day, like your thoughts on John Jones and Stipe and Tom. Uh, I'm just curious, though, given what Tom did, just to Curtis Blades, who do you look at as the true heavyweight champion right now? Is it John Jones or Tom Aspinall? I mean, let's be honest. John Jones is a real champ. Um, Tom did what he he's supposed to do as an interim champ because he's in line for the for the next championship fight. But John Jones is a real champ. Nothing to, to take nothing away from Tom. He did an amazing job, and yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. You know, if you want to stay in line. Sorry, just because over here. Sorry, mate. Um, recently, you said you, you went home to Suriname to help prepare for this fight. How did that go, and how has that helped you prepare for this fight with time? I went home, um, spent some time with my friends and family, and I started my camp there. It was good. It was perfect. Uh, it's all that I needed, and now I feel fully charged. Um, I can't wait to go to go to war this Sunday. Uh, recently, Ty mentioned that he was excited to fight you because he's not fighting a wrestler. Uh, did you see those comments? And also, I want to touch on what you said recently in an interview where you might show off some more of your MMA skills. What exactly did you mean by that? Are you going to stick with your traditional kickboxing and striking, or could we see some wrestling? Could we see some grappling from you? Uh, I did saw the, the comment he made. I even posted it on my Instagram. Um, come on, it's MMA. Why should I not <laughs> wrestle? If I, if I have an opportunity to wrestle, slow him down, for example, why not? It's MMA. Um, I know I'm an amazing kickboxer. I did it uh, many years. I'm a champion in 10 different uh, organizations. So um, it's all a matter of time to see uh, who's going to be the best this Sunday. And recently as well, you said that you're very accustomed to five-round fights. Do you see this fight with Ty even getting out of the, uh, to the third round, or do you think it's going to end it pretty early in that? Ah, you know what I think? Um, I go for the first round knockout all the time because I know I have the ability. 
Um, but if it goes to the second round or the third round, I might take my time, finish it off, make it a proper knockout, brutal, crazy, highlight. Thank you, you know? man.